It's midterm time at Brigham Young University, and this is the time of year can be very stressful for college students. Newsline reporter Desiree Assis has some tips on how students can manage that stress and get help. During the midterm season, many students meet at the library where they spend long hours going through intensive studying and preparation for their exams. The lack of sleep, heavy workload, and the need to meet deadlines are major factors of students becoming victims of stress. Balancing my schoolwork and getting like homework in on time can be hard when I am feeling anxious or what have you. So that's the biggest stressor for me. While stress is very normal and can act as motivation for students, too much stress can definitely interfere with academic success. I have like anxiety and depression and so sometimes I need extra time to complete assignments, which is helpful because I do have accommodation letters, but there is that stress of being able to balance the demands of my time academically and, you know, my mental health. Students who experience distress are not alone. Most universities around the country offer help and counseling to students who are struggling. Brigham Young University accepts walking visits at their counseling and psychological services office. There, students talk with professional counselors that help them navigate through managing stress during the school year. Students can also stop by to get training flyers or visit their website where they can find many helpful resources as well. Some of the helpful tips students will find are how to do breathing exercises, educational TED Talks about stress, and apps they can download on their phones that help with meditation and sleep. Friends and family can also play an important role in helping students succeed. According to the BYU Counseling Psychological Services website, if you want to help a student who is experiencing stress, you can listen to the student, be supportive, and encourage them to make an action plan or seek further help. Reporting for Newsline in Provo, I'm Desi Assis.